Hey everybody, it's Sirius313, and we are back today with another highly, highly, highly requested install, and it's EUP, otherwise known as Emergency Uniforms Pack. Today we're going to be doing an install and sort of a showcase on it. I wouldn't, uh, you wouldn't believe all the people I get asking how to install this, and it is just so simple. But um, if you're not familiar with Open4 and package installing, then it can be a little difficult. So what does uh, Emergency Uniform Pack allow you to do? It allows you to create your own officer um, just by typing it in and going to the free mode. But I'm going to show you all that. So there's two types of downloads to get in this. There's the actual main one, which is 143 megabytes. And there's the 161 kilobytes. This is a fix. This is not it. So people um, saying that, hey, I installed it and it's not working. I got the newest one. This is why. It's a fix. So you do want to uh, download both of those. I have these already downloaded, so let's go ahead and get to it. So first step is we're going to copy out the EUP from the copy folder, put it in the install folder, and then extract it. So we'll just go ahead and extract this here. Right here we go. And you're going to have the uh, package file right there. We always read the readme. we got the documentation right here. Oh, he even puts in the controls. So if you want to know how to um, make things different, it's right there. I use a controller, so I won't be using that. So the readme, we open it up. And basically it's saying if you are updating or upgrading, you want to delete out the menu files. Make sure you do that. So step one, extract it somewhere. We did that. Um, go to Tools, Package Installer, so let's follow along. So it says to go to Open4, go to Tools, Package Installer. Brings up this window. What's the next step? Load OIV. So we're going to find it in here, which is why we install it or extract it and put it in our install folder. All right, we go 7.3, and it wants this file. Just hit Open, and wait for the installation process to complete. So it tells us a little bit about it. Just hit install. And we want mods folder as always. And I did forget to mention that it is by Alex Ashford. Definitely want to give credit to the creator. The guy is an amazing um, modder with the content that he makes. Makes our life so much easier. Okay, so now that we have it, that's it. It's already installed through the open four. So let's just hold an X out of here. And then it says to put all the files found in the menu folder in the GTA 5 directory. So how that looks is we just open up our GTA folder. We'll move it over here. I'm going to grab the tutorial folder because that's what I'm using right here. And it wants us to use right over here the menu. Just right here. It wants us to grab all this one shot and just pop it in. And then it goes right into the plugins, and you can see it right there. Now, what you got to be aware of is when you're using this, you have to, when you launch Rage, you have to hold Shift. Or you can type it in as a, a plugin menu, but I like to hold Shift. That's how I do it. So we'll wait for the Rage menu to come up. I'm still holding Shift. Right here, we go to Plugins. And you want to make sure that load plugins is is in. So we got it right there. And then we just save and launch our game. All right, guys, I'll see you in game and I'll show you off this mod. All right, here we are. We're going to about to uh, check out the emergency uniform pack. Now, like I said, you can go to F4. You can hit load plugin and EUP will be here if you don't do the rage menu. And that's how you load it up. So we already have it in. So we're not going to do that. So now I'm going to show you, uh, it said F11 is how to bring it up. So we bring it up with F11 right there. And basically what it allows you to do is change the wardrobe. You can change the main apparel. You can create your character. Yeah, so now I have a complete thing, uh, model that I can make. I can name however I want. So the key thing is the, the, uh, the apparel. That's what everyone wants to see. So this is how you dress your officer really quick. So let's say I'm ready for SWAT, need to get ready for uh, a noose. Let's do this. We'll just hit enter. We'll get them dressed real quick. And then you got, you got all kinds of different agencies, but this is where you come to get dressed. 
Let's see here. We got uh, San Andreas Highway Patrol, Long Sleeve. I mean, they got tons of um, tons of uniforms, like the main apparel. Then you have hats. Then you have glasses. Let's go ahead and go back a little bit here. Just want to show you. So you can make characters. You can load characters. So if you create a character by name and they have a certain outfit, this is how you can pull them up. You can edit a character at any time. I usually keep one character of my own, and then I just uh, go into edit and I'll change the apparel uh, when I want to do that. So let's say I want to do, uh, let's look for LSPD. So we're going with the long sleeve today. Now you can see our long sleeve, we're complete with our belt. We look uh, a lot more legit than, than usual. We got the tactical uniform if we want to do that. So this is just a quick way to uh, dress your emergency personnel really quickly. I don't think there's that much more left to show you on this except that you can change your appearance. Uh, there's literally a creation module in, in this mod as well. You have heritage if you want to pick how your pe person looks with family. Uh, let's see editing the character loading a character so if you had um people uh existing characters from the last eup you can load them up through here or skin control that shit relieves stress, bro. i bet it does okay so Finish smoking that shit and dude call me back. who is doing that hey knock it off he's lucky we're not on duty Oh, now we are. Let's go get him. But, <laughs> hey, come back here. Well, all right, guys, that is EUP, uh, the Emergency Uniform Pack. Hopefully you liked this video. You found it helpful. Uh, let me know what you want to see down in the comments. I'm open to requests. So until next time, the Sirius 313, and I am out.